All right, the penultimate race of the day is a four-mile hand hunter chase over a North 100 Ted Handicap Hunter Chase. Four starters, Ferns Bullet, Martin Leedham, Grand Torino, Paul Rhodes, Maggie Saucier, Obi-Wan and Pride of America, Paul Rhodes. So four starters, and it's Flynn's Bullet for Martin Leedham. He'll lead some Pride of America for Paul Rhodes. Grand Torino is also Paul Rhodes back in third. And Maggie Saucier for Obi-Wan. Terrible blunder by the Obi-Wan horse to the back of the field, but there's a long way to go. A lot of time to recover. It's Flynn's Bullet who jumps the next from Pride of America and Grand Torino, the two Paul Rhodes horses together. Maggie Saucier, Obi-Wan at the back of the field in this four-runner event. Yeah, Cottenham. And the Raiders stopped as Flynn's Bullet. Bullet leads them from Pride of America in second, Grand Torino back in third, then Maggie Saucier for Obi Wan the black horse, the yellow colours. Um, about three less bound than her last horse, and Paul Rose in more familiar colours in this race. It's Flynn's Bullet in those red colours and yellow sleeves, red colours and, ye color and yellow cap. The leads from Grand Torino in second, so jump the next. So Grand Torino, the light brown horse, and the darker brown horse is Pride of America. And Maggie Saucier at the back of the field. The black horse, the yellow colours. For Obi Wan, he's about eight lengths off this leader, but there's a long way to go. Another 26 fences as Flynn's bullet takes him along for Martin Leadham from Grand Torino in second. The jumper next. And they all over it well enough. Slightly slow at the back, Maggie Saucier, but nothing to be worried about as Flynn's bullet leads him from Grand Torino in second. There's about four lengths in between each horse. As Pride of America is in third, and Maggie Saucy at the back of the field. About 12 lengths off the leader as Flynn's Bullet leads from Grand Torino. Good jump by the leader. Pride of America is back in third, they come to the next. And another good jump by the leader, Flynn's Bullet. His jumping has been superb to date. Grand Torino back in second, the jumper next. Slightly slow in front this time, I just to say that Flynn's Bullet jumps slightly slow. Then Grand Torino back in second, Pride of America back in third, and Barbara is back to Maggie Saucier for Obi Wan at the back of the field. So Flynn's Bullet for Martin Needham, the leader. From in second, Grand Torino. Then comes Pride of America, the jump the next. They're all over it. Well, it was just what's Maggie Saucier across the fence now. Flynn's Bullet jumps the next, jumps it well. Grand Torino, a terrible blunder in second. Pride of America, well enough back in third, but also a blunder at the back by Maggie Saucier, who is now about six lengths off the last horse. So Flynn's Bullet takes him along for Martin Leadham. From Grand Torino in second. Then comes the darker brown coloured Tucker Brown horse with the same colours. Pride of America for Paul Rhodes and Maggie Saucier still at the back of the field. They jump the next. Good jump by Flynn's Bullet. Um, and also Maggie Saucier is well enough at the back of the field, but he's about 15 minutes off the seat. But it's still a long way to go. It's still a long way to go as they pass the stands and pass the winning posts again. That's going to go to two more circuits after this one. So three more circuits to go. Flynn's Bullet from Grand Torino. Pride of America back in third. And they're all over it well. Rushing for Maggie Saucier jumps it slowly at the back of the field. It's about 10 lengths off the third horse now, Maggie Saucier. So Flynn's Bullet from Gran Torino is moved up into second, about two lengths behind the leader now. Uh, just beyond that is Pride of America and 10 or 12 lengths back to Maggie Saucier at the back of the field. Flynn's Bullet. Martin Leadham with red colours in the lead from the two blue coloured horses. Uh, in Grand Torino and Pride of America for Paul Rhodes and the yellow colours at the back Maggie Saucier for Obi-Wan about 10 lengths off the last horse uh, Maggie Saucier anything can happen there's a long way to go a lot of fences to jump so they all have some sort of a chance to jump to the next one Flynn's Bullet over as well the stake in second for Grand Torino has been passed by Pride of America and Maggie Saucier who has been at the back of the field Flynn's Bullet Led from start, different start from the start. We saw three lanes clear of Pride of America in second, who's past his stable companion, Grand Torino. They jump the next good jump by the leader, another slow jump by Grand Torino, and a terrible jump at the back of the field by Maggie Saucier, who's dropped further behind this field now. It's about 15 or 16 lanes behind the third horse. So the front three are separated by about four lengths, and it's Flynn's bullet the leader for Martin Needham. One in second, Pride of America is a jump the next. Slow jump by the second and the third. So both Paul Rose also the slow. Better jump at the back by Maggie Saucier. But Flynn's bullet jumps the next well. From Grand Pride of America in second. Then Grand Katrina. And a slow jump again at the back from Maggie Saucier. And a 
Deere gets away from that well. Flynn's bullet is extended again. He's five lengths clear of Pride of America in second. Gran Torino's back in third. And Maggie Saucy is struck in at the back of the field. So Flynn's bullet the leader from Pride of America in second. Then comes Gran Torino back in third. They're followed by Maggie Saucier who jumps out. He's still in the race. It's about 12 minutes behind the third horse now. They jump the next. Flynn's Bullet from Pride of America and Gran Torino. Then Maggie Saucier. It's Flynn's Bullet in front from Pride of America and Gran Torino as they proceed, approach their home straight for the penultimate time. And it's Flynn's Bullet in front from in second Pride of America. Then comes Gran Torino, uh, followed by Maggie Saucier. A jump. Oh, a terrible blunder by the leader. Reach for it and just managed to stay upright. Flynn's bullet has been joined by Pride of America. Gran Torino only about two lengths back in third. And then comes Maggie Saucier. It's about 12 lengths behind these as they pass the winning post for the penultimate time and head out in the final circuit. And Flynn's bullet is now got company. Pride of America is just on his outside. Then comes Gran Torino only about two lengths back. And followed by Maggie Saucier. He is trying to get closer. A terrible blunder to get mistake by Pride of America that time it's Flynn's Bullet now from Gran Torino they come to the next slow jump by Flynn's Bullet being passed now by Gran Torino then comes Pride of America Maggie Saucier now get, getting closer but he's all got a lot of ground to make up nine fillers left to travel Gran Torino on the outside of Flynn's Bullet then comes Pride of America Maggie Saucier still going at the back of the field Getting back up to the front now, Flynn's bullet for Martin Needham from Gran Torino in second. Then Pride of America for Paul Rhodes. And the back of the field, Maggie Saucy for Obi-Wan. Still got about this 10 lengths to make up. He is closing, but he's got, still got a lot of ground to close. Flynn's bullet from Gran Torino in second. Then comes Pride of America. And Maggie Saucy is still going to the back of the field. It's Flynn's bullet clear from Gran Torino and Pride of America. They've got seven footers left to travel. Flynn's bullet has led most of the way from Gran Torino in second. Pride of America behind that and then Maggie Sauce and Abby pushed along to try and prove. It's Flynn's bullet is kicked again from the front and it's gone clear about four lands. Comes to the next, jumps it well. Slow jump by Pride of America. Gran Torino is trying to close down this leader. Maggie Sauce here is getting closer to those. It's Flynn's bullet to the back of the field. Flynn's bullet is still clear from, from his second Pride of America. American Gran Torino, then comes Maggie Saucier. Flynn's bullet comes to the next, jumps it well enough from a Gran Torino was slow, then comes Pride of America and Maggie Saucier. It's Flynn's bullet as it comes to the next, jumps it well from Gran Torino in second, who is closing, then comes Pride of America. It's Flynn's bullet comes to the next, and he's hanging tough in front. Flynn's bullet from Martin Needham, three lengths clear off Gran Torino and Pride of America. Maggie Saucier making no impression. It's Flynn's bullet as they come to these two before they head to the home straight and it's Flint's bullet from Pride of America there's three fences left to jump Flint's bullet over it well from Pride of America and Gran Torino then comes Maggie Saucier two fences left to jump Flint's bullet jumps the next well enough slow jump by Pride of America then comes Gran Torino and and Maggie Saucier Flint's bullet Grand Pride of America is closed on the outside it's Flint's bullet up the inside Grand Pride of America closed on the outside as they turn for home Flint's bullet on the inside on the outside outside Pride of America now hits the front Flynn's bullet is trying to fight back up the inside they come to the last fence going to go down to jumping in the last and there's a slow jump by Flynn's bullet Pride of America wasn't much better but Pride of America has the advantage now Maggie Saucy is getting going it's Flynn's Pride of America Flynn's bullet Maggie Saucy has gone into third but Pride of America wins for Paul Rhodes from Flynn's bullet from, Ma from Martin Needham the long time leader Maggie Saucy ran on everything when the race is over for Obi-Wan to finish third and a lot of jumping errors for the other Paul Rhodes also finished fourth but the winner Pride of America Paul Rhodes wins the Hunter Chase Flynn's bullet was second for Martin Leedham Obi-Wan Maggie Saucier third and Grand Arena finished fourth got some prize money for Paul Rhodes